part of that shit. Those cops will come for you if you're pulling that crap. and destruction in Minneapolis tonight as police officers and protesters clash over a man's death. Thanks for watching WCCO, also streaming on CBSN Minnesota. The outrage began with a video showing police arresting 46-year-old George Floyd in South Minneapolis last night. What? I can breathe. Please leave my neck. In the video, you can see an officer kneeling on Floyd's neck, pinning him to the ground outside Cup Foods on Chicago and East 38th Street. Floyd died a short time later. Today, hundreds flooded the streets at that same intersection to protest Floyd's death. They then marched to the police station where the officers who arrested Floyd worked. Our team coverage begins tonight with Jeff Wagner. He joins us now from outside the Minneapolis Police 3rd Precinct where a crowd is still gathered. Jeff? Yeah, this crowd, you know, I want to say comparative to about an hour ago, it's calmed down a bit, but then next thing you know, you start to hear the sound of tear gas being fired, flashbangs being fired. We've had what believes to be rubber bullets of sorts fly not far from us, hearing people get hit. There's still hundreds of people here who are actually standing right by the third precinct, right next to the officers. Uh, it's been a pretty chaotic scene starting about 6 p.m. tonight. A far cry from what it was earlier. Now, this all started at